Jamaica is our home and we want to explore it and share those moments with you. That includes the food, the places, in general, our culture. This, this is Yard Mens. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Yard Mens. Hey, we want to thank you so much for subscribing, for commenting, for sharing. It has been a great one week so far and um, we want to thank you for that um i'm sean and i'm devi and i just want to reiterate it was so amazing to see the support and the love from you guys and for those of you who haven't yet subscribed please remember to subscribe and like comment and share so today what we'll be doing is another fun video we'll be doing a video on banana chips which we have here we have some of them here about five of them and most jamaicans really like banana chips i personally love banana chips and i'm i love to snack and these are the things that i usually snack on so what we're going to be doing today is giving our thoughts and opinions on them so if you want to see that stay tuned, stay tuned. Okay guys, so today we have Saldanza. We have this banana chips here from uh, Free Hill. I've never heard of that one, but you know, we'll see today. <laughs> I think this is Jamaica's favorite, chippies. Yeah, I said that too, I love chippies. And then we have St. Mary, which is, you know, mm. new-ish <laughs> for the market. It has been around for a while, but it's kind of newish. And then this is the, one of the newest ones. It's um, Chaka Cheetahs, banana chips from Nationals. Um, yeah, that's that's new. So which one you want to start? Which one? I think, I think I want to start with the national one first. Right. So this is how it looks. I feel like it and the saldanza is probably like one of the biggest bags. Um, and it says that it is lightly salted. It has zero trans fat, no cholesterol. And the weight of it is 1.6 ounces. We purchased these in our local supermarket. Um, and the price for this one, um, based on the weight, was fifty four dollars and ninety four cents um that doesn't include tax um so yeah we're gonna try this now hopefully we can open it without it spreading all over the place maybe you should open it. <laughs> you're strong oh, okay that was easy. all right so i don't think i've had this one before so this is probably gonna be the first time i'm having this one I think it's a bit salty though, like just the first bite, it's salty. Yeah, I think so. so. For the taste, it's a bit salty, even though it says on the packaging that it's lightly salty. I think it's a bit salty. All right, you can understand. I do like the packaging <laughs> though. This is really nice um, with the, the graphic of the lady, you know, kind of a market type of vibe, but um, it's it's okay. It's yeah, okay. and I don't think the price is that bad. For how much you get in there, there's a good amount in there. Cause you know, say, sometimes it's their ear in them snacks here, but I think it's a good amount in, in in it, so it's not that bad. Yeah. So out of five, what do you think you'd give it? Two. I'd have said two. That's exactly what I was thinking. Two, actually. Definitely two. All right, you go choose the next uh, one. Let's try this one. I've never had this one before. This is the Me either. Free Hill banana chips. Yeah, and it's made in Jamaica actually. This one um was this one is a product of I think it's, um, Ecuador. Ecuador. This one was a pro the national one was a product of Ecuador. And this one it says it's uh, manufactured in Jamaica, so this mm -hmm. is a Jamaican product. Yeah. Uh, so you guys look out for this Bill Jamaica by Jamaica. Free Hill <laughs> banana chips, and um, the price for this one was uh, fifty dollars, fifty dollars and sixty-five cents. Mm -hmm. um, you you can find this as well in our local supermarkets. Yeah. So let's see what it tastes. Like. The pocket is really small, though. Like. Yeah. How much is in it? Um, it's what thirty grams. Thirty grams. Thirty grams. I like how the chips look. It kind of look nice and fried versus this one. It doesn't look that. It kind of look. Yeah. So I can try this one. I don't remember the name. It reminds me of a banana chips. Um, that we used to have? Yeah. I'm not sure the name, but. It's not so salty, which is good. Yeah, it's not um, salty at all. And the chips is not bad. It it it, it have a nostalgic taste to it. I, I'm trying to remember that. It kind of tastes kind of, I don't know, not as crunchy, but it's all right. It's all right. It's all right. So out of five, I think I'd have to say. I give this one a three. 
Mm, I would give it like a 1.5 to be honest. <laughs> I don't know. It's not my favorite. I don't know. Yeah, let's try to make. I think we should, let's leave this one for last. Yeah, I think we should leave yeah, this for last. We leave this one for last. Uh, let's go with Saldanza. Saldanza. No, I buy a lot of Saldanza chips. Um, they have a lot of different flavors. I really love the sweet and spicy one. That's my favorite one. I love that one. So this one comes in at um, 45 grams, and yeah. this one is a uh, product of. Costa Rica. Mm -hmm. And the, this was actually the most expensive one. It came in at $72.96. So, yeah, let's try this one. I'm gonna try two. Oh, the pot is crunchy. Yeah, nice. Really crunchy. Not really too nice. salty. It's really nice. It's really nice. Yeah. Salty it's kind of salty, salty, but not, not salty. really. But it tastes really fresh. And that's, that's what I really like with Saldanza products. They always seem to be very fresh. Um, for me, I'll definitely give it a three. Um, I'll give this fun. one. A, I'll give this one a three out of five. Not, not my favorite. Uh, we'll try the Saint Mary. Saint Mary. I think Saint Mary has take, taken Jamaica by storm. Like yeah. everywhere you go, yes, it's Saint Mary. So you can't, everywhere. you can't miss this yellow and green yeah. packet. It is this really one you can get everywhere. You can get it at shop. Everywhere. You can get it at supermarket. You can get it at wholesale. Street side. Yeah, street side everywhere. everywhere. And and that's a, a big thing. That's a thing that they have definitely capitalized on in the distribution. It's really good for the Saint Mary's line. Crunchy, soft. Yeah, it's soft. This one is soft. It has, you know, it tastes like it has salt on it, but it also tastes kind of like it has kind of other seasonings in there. So it's not just only salty tasting, but you're getting a little spice. Right. Like they season it with something else. Right. Um, this actually costs forty nine dollars and fifty nine cents. And it is a product of the yeah, says so. And America. this package, yeah. So, yeah. so, but for Saint Mary, I'll definitely give it uh, four because um, I do eat Saint Mary a lot um, because it's widely available and um, it is kind of one of my favorites. So yeah. I'll give it a four. I will give it a three point five. Yes, I'm a harsh critic. <laughs> so Jamaica is one yes, of Jamaica's favorites. Yes, I'm really excited chippies, about chippies. Chippies, chippies. chippies has been around for a while. Like, a long time. From a little boy, like yeah. chippies are like. You know, Jamaica's favorite chips, I think, yeah. I think. And this one is the second most expensive one. It came in at $67.56. And the thing that I really can't stand is that you can never find these. Like, yeah. you have to go to so many different places to get it. But I think people really love it. So whenever they see it, they buy a whole heap. A lot. They buy a whole lot. So I, I know already that I'm going to really love this one. I'm going to even take it off. Oh. Alright, so <clears throat> chippy has been one of my favorites, but unfortunately it's not so available on the market when you want it. But it is one when I see it, I definitely buy it any and every time. Um I do think though that they can um try to make the chips a little bit bigger, I think. I would I would love to see that. You know, yeah. if chippies could make the chips them a little bit bigger, but they can um, be a little bit crunchy at all. Right. It's but crunchy. The flavour is really nice. Not say. too salty and the flavour is always nice. So I'm yeah. I'm definitely a fan of chippies. It yeah, is me too. A product of Jamaica mm -hmm. as well, so I guess that's why it's always sold sold out. So I, yeah. I don't know. So yeah, chippies people is love definitely. Chippies. Big up in yourself. No, no. Like if you don't love chippies. Hashtag chippies. Comment if you don't love chippies. I know I love chippies. Alright. So that's so, it. So out of five, how much you giving it? Four point five out of five. Add the four. Add the four. <laughs> I said for you know I always have to go a little bit. It is nostalgic. You can't. You always have to yeah. remember that chippies from back in the day. Yeah. It, it is the same package from way back then. It, they don't change the package, so yeah. you can't miss this white with the chef on it. Like yeah. It is a trademark. Yeah, you man. know. But yeah. um, I guess my favorite out of all of this is definitely chippies. Yeah, my favorite is chippies. Definitely, definitely. I already knew coming into this that it would be my favorite. So. <laughs> I really love chippies. Alright, so guys, there you have it. This is our thoughts on um, different types of banana chips. I'm sure that we'll miss out one or two. Yeah. So you can comment and tell us your favorite banana chips. Yeah. Uh, comment what you think we have missed out and commenting on and just keep eating chips. It's, it's yeah. good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We love chips. It's a kind of healthy snack, <laughs> I would say. And um, we really would appreciate if you subscribe, if you like, and you comment. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. Bye. Don't forget to share as well. Yardmans. Yardmans.